Christy Weiss. And I'm Nick Dykus, and here are your announcements for November 18, 1993. Do you know a senior that is community-minded, who is motivated, or is a leader? The yearbook is looking for just those seniors to honor in a senior of distinction in the 1994 yearbook. You may nominate a student for this honor until November 19th. Forms are available in the main office. Dancers from Murder on the Nile. See Mrs. Brundage Friday regarding costumes. Thank you. If you are interested in joining the Kersley Ski Club, memberships will be sold starting next week. The cost of the membership is $6. For more information, please see Mr. Winkler in room 401. If you are interested in forming a Science Olympiad team, please sign up in room 401 between Thursday, November 18th and Tuesday, November 23rd. The ski swap will take place at Mount Holly this Saturday. For more information, see Mr. Winkler in room 401. Attention junior class officers and representatives. There will be a brief meeting this Friday after school to follow up on the basketball game meet in room 402. Bring out prizes that you have collected. Christy? Today's food for thought. Are you interested in both sports and exercise? Do you like helping people? Recreation therapists help people who have had accidents or diseases that have left them disabled in some way. The job outlook for recreation therapists in the 1990s is excellent. Junior class, don't forget to sell your poinsettias. Your forms must be in to Mr. Walworth or Mrs. Twos on Monday after Thanksgiving. It's your prom. Let's all participate. Sell those poinsettias. The menu for today is cheeseburger, veggie sticks, mixed fruit and milk. The $1.75 lunch is chicken nuggets. The cook special is beef gravy over mashed potatoes. The light lunch is chicken salad sandwich. Kersley's Quiz Bowl team took two out of three matches yesterday to improve their record to six and three. Now over to, or we'll be right back after a commercial. Hello there. When I come home from a hard day's job at work, I like to just sit back, relax, read a good book, and listen to the Kersley Winter Holiday Spectacular. The album has all your favorite hits. You can't help but sing along and dance along. of that choir to help you sing along and get through some of that hard work. Order your cassette for $10 or your CD for $15 at lunchtime or ask Mr. Bushy. Hey, we've got the graphic. Where's the graphic? Nice bricks. <laughs> Swim practice. We'll begin on Monday, November 29th. Morning practice will be from 6 to 7. Afternoon practice will be until 4.30. Please pick up a revised schedule from Coach Mao. The varsity hockey team defeated Powers last night 5-4. to four. Mike Sly scored three goals to lead the team to a victory. Terry Ketter and Joseph Lustig also scored. The team will play against Davison on Sunday at 8.30. Boys varsity basketball practice today is from 245 to 445. JV is from 4 to 6. We want to congratulate Wayne Thayer, who was the MVP, was elected MVP for cross country, and Anthony Wilson, most improved. What's this? We just got an announcement in. Attention all girls who are trying out for volleyball. There will be an aerobic class on Thursday. That's today from 7 to 8. Cost is $1. $1. Please attend. Now we're going to go to Drew. Hey, Brian. Yes. Also, congratulations to the girls' hoops yesterday. Did you say something about that? or? Uh, they, they, won. I didn't, they, they won over Northern. Yeah, real close game at the very end. They won by two points, and which means they'll go on to play Grand Blank, I think it's going to be whoever won the Grand Blank Flint Central game on Friday, and I'm sure they'll win that too. Right. Hey, Brian, I got one other question for you. Yes. Are you allowed to wear that shirt on at night? Um, I don't think so. No, I, I don't think so either. I think you're I'll right. Try you know, since we are coming up on the 30th anniversary of the assassination of President Kennedy, the U.S. has just released some more information from the confusing and misleading investigation. Now, it appears that it wasn't Lee Harvey Oswald. It was two guys named Harvey and Oswald. And it wasn't a grassy knoll 
it was a gassy troll. So. All right, all right. They just get worse and worse. Let's take a look at the uh, forecast for today. Rain should start out early. It'll be dry in the afternoon, however, a high around 55 degrees. And then for Friday, scatter shower. I think I think Steve that's supposed to read scattered showers. A high around 55 to 60 degrees. And then our extended outlook, while well, it's going to be cooling down for the weekend, and on Sunday we'll be warming back up, and Monday will be even more of a warming trend. Don't forget the K News Line, 736. That says K News Line, not News Slime. 736-3164, extension 699. And hey, it's old Spanish OO Wico right here on K News. And we have with us... Jennifer Wilson. And... Carissa Keller. And they are uh, two excellent Spanish students, would you say? E or excellento? Yes. Oh, that's right. They have to speak this whole thing in Spanish, even if I ask them a question. So we'll let them say the weather, and then we'll have a little bit of fun with them. So go ahead and say what the weather is for today. El tiempo hoy está nublado con un mucho el sol. Which means? It's sunny outside. Okay, okay. Go ahead, Jen. Pero hace mucho frío. También nosotros estamos mejores lucoturas que tú. Which says? says it is cold and we are better hey, in Spanish please I just said <laughs> it in Spanish <laughs> okay so uh, I'm, I'm gonna ask them now a question in English and we'll have them do you want to translate the question into Spanish or do you want to answer it in Spanish we'll answer it in Spanish answer it in Spanish okay something like uh, my car is in the garage okay my engine needs work okay <laughs> this is this is going somewhere trust me Brian the question that I want you to answer is, should I get my muffler replaced or should I get my tie rods fixed? Um, disculpo, polo, pero lo, no lo sé. All right, yes, get the tie rods fixed. Good answer, good answer. Who's gonna be here tomorrow, do you guys know? Um, Bob, I think. Oh. Bob and John Mulally. Bob. John Mawinney and Bob Crang will be here tomorrow. Sounds like fun. And now, can you say in Spanish, can you say, let's go over to Jen, who's on assignment? Um, or you, can you just say, let's go over to Jen? Or? Vamos. Let's go. Let's, yeah. Jen. Ah, Jen. Did you hear that, Jen? We told you twice, we told you a thousand times. If you're going to bring valuables to school, set your lockers. There's been even more reported stealings within the last few weeks. So, if you're going to bring money, coats, expensive jewelry, whatever it is to school, don't forget to set your lockers. I'm Genuel for K News. Well, that's it for your morning announcements. We're going to leave you with a couple of bloopers. Bye. Ursley's Quiz Bowl team took two out of three okay, minutes Steve? yesterday. Their record. Guys, we got a couple problems here. Christy, <laughs> Steve goes in there to change the set, and you have your. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Yes, don't forget to sell your point set up. Wow. I think there's. I think, Nick, Nick, are you okay there? <laughs> Someone getting Nick a medic? 